And now we're on the second floor. What's in here? No, it's another room. What's it over here? No, 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 there's some special notes here on the second floor. Take four hits. No, it wasn't that. It was the beast cutter I was using last time. Actually able to reach that far and kill them. at me. that fucking shit in my face, you little pussy. It's not the damage that bugs me so much as the stagger. Nothing in a game pisses me off more than unresponsive controls, and when you stagger, your controls don't respond at all. Communion. Yummy. Master Willem was right. Evolution without courage will be the ruin of our race. Hunt the Great Ones. Hunt the Great Ones. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, this way. Disa way. The Nameless Moon Presence beckoned by Lawrence and his associates. Pale Blood. So the final boss of the game, well, the final boss, the third, 
uh, second optional boss is the pale blood that we have come here to seek. Three third chords. That would be these. Thanks for the camera angles from Soft. Thanks for the camera angles from Soft. Really love those camera angles. Because that's the angle I want when I'm fighting a giant fucking monster who's right on top of me. Look, it's another one of Willem's rocking chairs. And a desk that looks just like the one in Bergenworth. And oh look, it's a little asshole who just can't wait to die. <laughs> oh, this cannot be. You cannot be. No, you didn't. Lord Amygdala? Oh, how did this come to pass? Better start begging, bitch. <laughs> now, wait just a moment. Do you think you love me? Me? Oh, it pains me to hear it. You've made yourself a misreckoning. I shared with you a thing most secret. Now, you're witness to a miracle. And all the stronger for it. It's plain as a pike staff. Now, say in my heart. You were as a lamb to my God. Well, you weren't to know, and it wasn't for you to know. All's well that ends well, I say. <laughs> You're gonna end well, all right. No matter. Such details are trifling. We're fast friends by now. Let this express what words cannot. Anti-clockwise metamorphosis for my stamina. Oh, d doubt me not, sweet compeer. What is friendship but a chance encounter? <laughs> ah, well met. My apologies, but I feel a profound thought occurring on the good grace of a certain god, and the way he meted out his love. <laughs> mm hmm We'll come deal with this little shit later. I'm not sure if killing him here prevents him from showing up in the Chalice Dungeons. Nightmare of Mensis. <coughs> now the silver beasts that are here will regurgitate a pair of uh, those wonderful fucking maggots unless you either kill them with finish them off with either a visceral attack or fire.
And that guy will run for the fucking ledge and kill himself if you let him. Now, before we go tackling this place, let's go get a few other things done. Welcome home, good hunter. What is it? Very well, let... Hmm... I think I'll get my blood tinge up a little first. Put that up to 15 and then skill up to 40. That should be a good balance. And I think for this character I'll actually go beyond level 100. Why not? I'm doing Chalice Dungeons. Going all the way down to depth 5. Farewell, good hunter. Now, still not the one moon. Oh my god, how the hell did I not swap this out before I started this? Jesus! Purity for the summons. Uh, I would put this on, but... Yeah, why not? Um, hmm, okay, what else? What else, what else, what else? Still working on those. Ah, what fortuitous circumstance be this? <laughs> oh, Lawrence, Master Willem, somebody help me, unshackle me, please, anybody. I've had enough of this dream. The night blocks all sight. Oh, somebody, please. Solve all your problems eventually. Oh, yeah, let's check the shops for anything new. I think. Yeah, now that we've beaten the one reborn, we can buy blood chunks. Yummy. Oh, that's right. I can upgrade my shit now. Still don't have a rock, but we're getting close. Two more and we'll be good for the cannon. Don't think I'm going to use a rock on the cannon. At least not until I get some from the Chalice Dungeons. Um, there's one in the main game, one in the DLC, three from treasure chests in the Depth 5 Dungeons, and three from the final bosses of Depth 5 Dungeons. Like, when you beat the final boss of a Depth 5 Dungeon, you have a chance that they will drop up to a total of three blood rocks combined so you might get one from one boss and two more after that but it's random so it's not like you get one from Lower Loran, one from Great Ease and one from Thumeru Eel. If you're going through the same dungeon enough times before doing the others, you could get all three blood rocks from three final bosses in Great Ease or whichever one you're doing. It's kind of random. But it's up to three and it's only the final boss of a Depth 5 dungeon. I should be saying this in the friggin' Chalice Dungeon shit, not here. Okay. Check these. Uh, no. What the fuck are you doing? Okay, well... Let's 
check the weakest one first, so it gives us the biggest boost. Even though this one's a higher tier and a higher rank, it's still not as good as this one. Because this one's adding physical and this one's adding arcane, which converts all our damage to arcane. Which is fucking stupid. Better blood gems? I kind of doubt it. That one looks pretty badass. Okay. Let's see now. Still haven't tackled much of the DLC. I probably ought to do some of that. Yeah, that's never going to work now. Once you kill Rom. thing we can do here. See? It's just like the desk back at the lecture hall. I mean, seriously, that's all they wanted to do with all these goddamn eyeballs they were collecting? Stick them in fucking jars and leave them? Got anything new to say? Yeah, I know. Jump off the ledge. Anything else? Alright then, you're fucking useless to me! And now we get the eye rune. Yay. And that's how you know that shit here in Yarnum hasn't been going on for very long. Provost Willem is still alive, and this whole... All this shit, aside from stuff in the Chalice Dungeons, started with him. I mean... Provost Willem predates the entire healing church. Oh, hello. Thank you. Provost Willem predates the existence of the healing church, which predates the baffling sickness, the church's blood healing, and then the scourge of beasts, and then the hunters, and the church hunters, all that shit came after Provost Willem, and he's still alive. So that right there tells you that everything that's happened in this game, aside from you know, the Great Ones and the Chalice Dungeons and the Ancient Thumerians, all that shit happened within a single lifetime. <clears throat> I mean, Willem was already old and laying in his rocking chair when Lawrence was still at Bergenworth, and then he left to go found the Healing Church, and, you know, in, in the time that all that shit's happened since then, Willem is still alive. <laughs> and 
that, plus the fact that the hunt seems to center around the moon, tells me that, uh, let's just get that up to 10, because that's annoying me. That tells you that, uh, yeah, the, the hunt centers around the moon. The moon is close tonight, the hunt will be long. That kind of tells me that the night of the hunt is a monthly occurrence. I want 10, but I can't afford it, you son of a bitch. Okay. What else, what else, what else? Checked everything there. I'm not going to kill Volter until he's served every goddamn bit of usefulness I can possibly squeeze out of him. Da -da -da -da. I'm not getting anything from those people. Oh, I should check up on them. unless I want to send you away to kill you. You're the same as usual, and you're batshit insane. So... Yeah, I think I'll end that right here. And next time, we're going to be going up to the Upper Cathedral Ward and the Orphanage. So until then, goodbye!